Hi everybody, it's Carolyn. And today we're going to draw a little summer fun. We're going to draw some flip-flops. So flip-flops are kind of easy, but they're not kind of easy. They There's a certain shape to grab, and um, so we're going to do that with some guidelines. So I want you to grab your paper, and then the first thing you're going to do is we're going to just draw a circle. And then on top of that circle, just like remember we drew an A kind of like this, we're going to come around and add a little bump out on the side. Do you see that? And then we're also going to add another circle at the bottom, maybe a little smaller. So we're going to come over here. And we're going to do the same thing. We're going to add a circle. And then we're going to add kind of that little bump out, just like it was an egg. Like that. And then we're going to do a circle down here. And this circle doesn't have to be as big as the top circle. But however you'd like to do that. Okay. So now I'm moving to my marker, and I want to just kind of add a little curved line there to connect those two, and a little curved line here. And I want to do the same thing here. A little curved line, and just a little curved line right there. And it's curved in. So as you can see, if I follow my lines around and follow that bump out, that's kind of where your big toe goes. And then, so if you notice, you have the shape of a flip-flop. There you go. So there's your big toe kind of. Okay. And then if you want, we're going to put the straps on it now so it can stay on your foot. So it's kind of in the center, but down about an inch from the top. And then we're going to draw our straps. So we draw a curved line and then a curved line. So right there. And then we're going to come over here and we're going to draw a logger line. There you go. Okay, and then we're going to do the same over here. So this is where your big toe goes. I don't know about you, but I can never wear these. I cannot have something around my big toe. It drives me crazy. So maybe too much information. Here you go. We're going to do this on one side again. It kind of bends a little bit. There you go. So if you erase, if I have an eraser, these guidelines, you can wear these. Now the fun thing about flip-flops is you can decorate them. There's every different kind of flip-flop possible. So you can do flowers, or you can do polka dots. Like you can make a, this one a polka dot one. It's all right to go off the sides. You can make them any color. Usually they're as bright as can be. This one might be like a, a striped one. Or it could be a diamond one too. You can have two different ones. You can have yours and your friend's flip-flops. 
So this is kind of a pretty easy one. And if you want to, everybody always asks, like, um, you know, how we drew our flowers. You can draw a flower with this. You can draw a couple flowers. Remember we drew a beach umbrella? You can draw your beach umbrella with your sandals. that. You can do anything you'd like. Maybe make the sun come up over here. We always have the sun. So the possibilities are endless. So I just want you to have fun with your flip-flops. You can even make a beach ball with your flip-flops which would be one, two, and then three. So all kinds of fun things, as if we're spending a day out on the beach and out in the sun. So enjoy drawing your flip-flops and decorating them using as many colors. And Feel free to share my videos with your friends and you guys can all draw together. So, um, but have a great day and enjoy the sun.